Um, all right, it's time to do the, uh, the, the our the, taste test. A little taste test here. But first, let's talk to Gino. Yeah. Um, because. Hi, Gino. Okay, Gino. Hey, how are you? Good. So tell us how this came about with the Lay's company, the potato chip people. Uh, well, we started about a year ago. They approached me and they said they want to come out with a Philly cheesesteak potato chip. And I kind of looked at them like, really? I was like, how are we going to be able to do that? But with the uh, seasonings, with getting the cheddar cheese, a little bit of the sour cream with the potato chip, we mixed it all together. And they came out with their own cheesesteak seasoning and put it all together and wind up um, making the cheesesteak potato chip. How and long it did took about that a year. take? Yeah, he makes it sound know? so simple. <laughs> Yeah, one year it took I going remember. back and forth, taste testing, which wasn't a bad job. I mean, I got to taste a bunch of chips. <laughs> yeah, how and, many do you uh, think you, you know, tried with to taste Mark, uh, Well, my crew did, and uh, the workers gave us their feedback about uh, the seasoning. It tasted uh, not enough like a steak. It didn't have enough cheese. It needed a little bit more of an onion flair to it. So we went back and forth uh, about a half a dozen times. Half a dozen. So, undoubtedly, but you're, you're happy I gotta, now? Yeah, very happy. But the only thing is, Mike, I heard you didn't share the chips with uh, Alex over there. So, Alex, I sent you your own personal bag. Thank you. And plus, I guess we shouldn't be sharing anyway. We're in the middle of a pandemic. That's Otherwise, right. I would share with all distant. my family and friends. <laughs> but thank you, Gino, for taking And thanks for sending over to Gino. Gino, I got my chips and Tom I got my cheesesteak yeah, as Thomas. well. So I'm excited. Yeah, I wanted to hear your uh, input. Yeah, I wanted to see your input, what you thought of it. Now, Gino? where can people get them? Yeah, where do you get them? Uh, you can get them all across the country, all the major stores, uh, convenience stores, and uh, ShopRites, and uh, Kroger's, and uh, Wegmans, all the general all stores. Over. You know how big a deal it's this nationwide. is? nationwide. This isn't just Philly, Excuse like me? you said. It's nationwide. Yeah, nationwide. They picked uh, five places, uh, iconic places for an iconic flavor, and I happen to be uh, very lucky to be one of them. I'm very honored. And rich. Because you know, Damn. you know, every time there's always a cheesesteak <laughs> debate, but you guys were chosen. Yes. Yeah, and a lot of people, what they're doing is taking a bite of the cheesesteak and a bite of the chip to see right. how much. And uh, so far, uh, Facebook has been blowing up on our uh, website so and on Facebook about everybody really liking the chip. Okay, so they say it tastes like it. All right. Well, congratulations. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. And I guess, would you say, I guess this is the lower calorie version, wouldn't it be? <laughs> Just eat some chips. <laughs> well, yeah, buy a couple of calories. <laughs> let you do the whole bag, which I might. I might, yeah. Gino, okay. congratulations. We'll be, uh, Thanks, Gino. We'll be checking yeah. back with you. Nicely done, brother. Thank All you, right. guys. Take care. See you later, Thomas. All right. Okay, All right, now, here. I oh, took my bite you. of the cheese. Oh, steak. you guys both took, okay, what'd you think? Um, I, I, I know what a cheese steak tastes like, so <laughs> that was not surprising. <laughs> oh, sorry, I thought you had the chip already. Okay, here we go. It tastes like juice <gasps> steak. It does? It it, yeah. Okay, my turn, my turn. Here I don't we go. know how they did it. Oh my gosh! It's like we're at the Willy Wonka factory or something. It it's weird. Like <laughs> Thomas, what do you think? Meh. No. <laughs> it actually does taste like a cheesesteak. Yeah, now that you taste mean the you onions. Like it or not. It's heavy on the onions. <laughs> <laughs> no. I do like the taste of a cheesesteak. And like it develops. I feel like the longer you chew it, then it gets more like I agree. You taste like the steak part and then it's like wow. This is going to be a hit. What does Lays have going on there? How do they do this? It's, it's good. really good. Hmm. Well, I'll be darned. And if you're on the go, you don't have time to eat this whole thing, you know. <laughs> it's a lot easier. Or if you're in the car, you don't want to hold the whole thing, you just want to quickly right. eat it. And I think people, I think it's just fun, especially here, because we are, like, known for cheesesteaks, um, just to try it. Like, get it for your friends and that kind of thing. Let's look at the caloric intake here. <laughs> Let's see what people like are saying it. on... There are eight servings in this bag. Now, who's good at math? Eight servings in the bag, and each serving is 160 calories. So, hmm. all right, if you eat an eighth of this bag, it's only 160. This is some good television right here. <laughs> no, watching us just <laughs> chew, chew away. Um, so, yeah, a lot of folks are saying that they, they want to definitely try it. Mm. That'd be how many in the whole bag, Kit Kat? Uh, 1,200 calories. Ooh. It's a big bag. 
Other people are saying they like that Philly's being represented because it's a whole yeah. series. So they're doing different. Yeah. I think there are five the restaurants around America that got, were chosen. Mm -hmm. I don't know what the other four are. Do we ever like? I wonder if like Pat's is upset. <laughs> Let's ask him. <laughs> we it's should good ask binge him. watching chips, isn't it? Before you know it, the whole bag is gone. <laughs> Oh, yeah. No, oh, I could finish that off today. <laughs> and I probably will. <laughs> um, that was fun. All right, so you guys let us know. When you get them, let us know if you agree that it tastes like a cheesecake. Oh, God. What? Really, I can't stop. What? <laughs> <laughs> I have no self-control. Well, you also, I never really see Mike eat, Thomas. So I'm sure he's starving by the time the show's over, because he never really eats here. No, I have a horrible uh, diet uh, plan. I drink coffee in the morning and eat about 2 o'clock in the afternoon. And that's it? And just stuff myself mm -hmm. and then take a nap and blow it up. <laughs> blow it up. <laughs> Don't do what I do. I'm on the same diet. <laughs>